we've received a total of 51,000 applications uh, countrywide. We've managed to give funds to around 46,000 groups, meaning that we still have a gap. Uh, you may be aware from our previous records that uh, we envisage to reach out to uh, uh, about 21,000 groups. But the applications, as you can see, they, it's almost uh, thrice our target. And uh, we've managed to uh, give out to those 46,000 groups. We still have a backlog of almost a, a, a jug. And uh, remember, this is a continuous process, even as we are seated here. Youth, women, and the disabled are applying for the fund. So uh, that addresses your question uh, in terms of challenges. Uh, we have so much to reach, uh, so many groups to reach out to, but uh, <coughs> the allocation is a challenge. We are here to learn more about Weso Fund, uh, on how they will uh, monitor, make follow-up of the activities at the constituency level. We are also training them to understand much on uh, table banking, which is a real backbone of Weso Fund. We are also training our committees to understand uh, on business development support, where uh, they need to understand the various uh, businesses that are found within their constituencies and their counties. As a fund, uh, it is within our mandate one to ensure that the funds that were set aside to benefit women, youth, and uh, disabled are distributed or loaned out to the real beneficiaries, and also to ensure that the various business ideas that are being developed are nurtured, and it is within our duty and our mandate to ensure that these businesses grow to greater heights.